Okay, so I wanted to show you some things that I'm doing to prepare for my week for the next couple of days and that kind of thing so I don't start running around saying, oh no, I don't have anything to eat. Um, so here we go. These are some kale chips. So I measured out, it's about three cups of kale. I tossed it in some olive oil and then I spread it on the pan. Tried to spread it out so that um, they're not so touching each other so much. And um, I also sprinkled it with salt. And I'm gonna put them in the oven for 350 degrees for 10 to 12 minutes. I'm gonna watch it a lot. I like mine not really um, burned, not really too brown. I like it a little bit on the, um, I guess, less crunchy side. I like to actually taste the kale. But you can do it a little bit crunchier. I was eating some of this yesterday and I was thinking this would be a great substitute for popcorn. Like if you literally, if you were going to sit and watch TV with popcorn, it's a great alternative. I don't know why, but it just reminded me of popcorn. Anyway, um, so kale, good snack. It is part of the two cups per meal on your, um, on your phase one sheet because we're cooking it. Okay, so I am preparing my lunch ahead of time, and this is a salad. It is made up of some arugula, some um, spring mix, some red cabbage, cucumber, all that is free, right? I can have as much of that as I want every day. And then I've also cut up two cups of bell peppers. So I have red, green, and yellow bell peppers. I'm gonna throw them in the salad. And um, yeah, this is gonna be my lunch. That is a lot of lunch right there. Looks delicious, can't wait to dig in. That's my husband's gingerbread house. And those are our fresh eggs from our chickens. Anyway, enjoy your lunch, ladies and gentlemen. So the question comes up, what am I gonna put on my salad? I made my own dressing. It basically is uh, apple cider vinegar. I love these cruets because, you know, it has exactly where the line that you put things. So I put apple cider vinegar, water, and I put olive oil, and then I added some gray Poupon mustard. It has zero carbs, just to kind of help emulsify it a little bit. And I put some garlic powder, some salt, pepper, and some um, herbs, uh, Italian herbs in there. And that's what I'm gonna have on my salad.